невозможно было это все понять, что вот в это It is impossible to understand how this could happen at this time, in our time, that this could happen to us before our eyes. It's very difficult to talk about. Мое поколение, оно уже родилось в депортации. My generation was born in deportation. I was born in Uzbekistan. But we were raised knowing our homeland was Crimea and that we must return there. Our parents did everything they could so that we could return. When we returned, we didn't ask for our homes or property back. We went to the authorities and said, give us land, we'll build and we'll live. We went to the authorities and said, give us land, we'll build and we'll live. We went to the authorities and said, give us land, we'll build and we'll live. In 2014, they suddenly denied us entry to the other side of the barricade. They denied us the people there with whom we associated, who we considered our friends. Our points of view were in complete opposition. What seemed dangerous for us seemed very good for them. And for the first time, I remember it very well, we lived with the feeling of being in danger, the feeling of constant tension. And then Akhtem was arrested. I don't really remember that time because it was catastrophic and unpleasant for me. I just didn't know what to do at that moment, what actions to take. How did this happen? Why? What for? But after a while, I grew tired of being afraid. Now we live and are very conscious of the fact that we didn't steal anything from anyone. We are living on our land. And moreover, we have the right to live on this land. It's even more painful to see these crazy plans that individual politicians are working on, saying that Crimea should be leased to Russia for 50 years, 100 years, and so on and so forth. They are strongly provoking us, and that's why I just want to scream and say we are not serfs to be put up for rent. We are the owners of this land, and we should be able to decide this question the way we want, ask us. But we also understand that Ukraine is going through hardships because there is a war in the East. People are being killed. But we really hope that society, politicians, and the president of Ukraine will do everything in their power to get back Ukraine's territorial integrity and become a strong European state. Mm -hmm.